hardest man on the cobbles has to be Mike Lavelle. Who's the hardest in the cast? I've got to say me. Uh, definitely Kevin Webster. He's had about 27 fights, won them all. I don't think there's a character in that green room. Could take him on. Right, Pops. <laughs> Ignore him, Kevin. Do without that kind of aggro to have any much. If anybody's going off the trolley down there, it ain't me, Dad. No, of course it isn't. He behaves like a perfectly rational human being, doesn't he? Like he did with me in here yesterday. You asked for that. He's a nutter. Listen, who's flaming hey, talking? Just you think you're playing at? I'm on match point. Sorry, but there's going to be no more tennis till we sort this out. This is so boring. Can't you accept anything? Have you sold him, Michelle? Of course I have. Right, cut off. I beg your pardon. Cut off, come on, I'm serious. She's going to take us. Buzz off, off, will you? you buzz off. Honestly, this is so childish. Yes? Michelle, tell him to clear off, will you? Look, you can't just gang up and reject somebody just like that, you know? Her father likes me. He even plays golf with me. Yes. Oh. <laughs> All right, mate, what brings you here? Having a nice sound together, have you? Well, I just went for a bit of a bath. Yeah. Night, so. And what about last night? Kevin! Get off of me! 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 Eddie! Come on, Tina! Eddie! Hey, come on. Leave it alone, eh? Hey, butt out, mate! Hey, take your hands off her! What's it to do with you anyway? Have you got a soft spot for yourself? Hey, would you rather it was your missus? <laughs> oh, hey, all right, all right, all right, that, that, that's enough, that's enough. You, you, out. Hey, I'm going nowhere. He picked on me. It's all right, Mr. Gilroy. We'll sort it out. Come on, son. Go on. on your back. Hey, you think you're going to get away with this either. Yeah. Hey, 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 That. Yes or no? Look, on the bed, talk about this in the street, all right? Did you sleep with her? You really want to know her? Okay, yeah, I do. You! Oh, oh. Kevin! Cut it out! Look, stay out with this, Des. No. You don't want to fight you, mate. It's too late for that. That's enough! Look, don't make me eat you as well, Des. Oh, you fancy yourself with your fist nowadays, dear Kev? Look, it's him or what, not you! Yeah, well, no way, just back off, right? Just do as he says, Kevin. And else what? Hey, you're supposed to be my mate! Do left her! What's this about? You stay out of this. It's about me sleeping with Sally, Sam. Oh. Kevin! Pack it in. Just cut it out, otherwise I'm gonna put you on your back and all. Okay. Okay. That's it, you're sacked! Oh. Don't come anywhere near the carriage. And also won't be responsible for what happens. Sally's made her choice, Kevin. Look, I don't expect you to be happy about it, but. You're you know. only after the money. You can't wait to get your hands on it. She was wasted on you. Was she? Well, she's thrown herself on a slag ain't now, all right? Hey, hey, come hey. on. Oh, come on, Sally. He's just playing games with you. Hey, you stay out of this, you. You're not going to leave him alone. You're just trying to make Sally feel guilty. Hey! Kevin, hey, stop him! Stop him! <laughs> Couldn't stand it, could you? Thought of Sally making a better life for herself, you sad hey, little loser. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, we're not too, Kev. Baldwin sacked us both. You happy now? To start. He's not worth it. Uh, may I see what it happened? No! Oh, I won't keep no! It. Get out! I don't want I you in my house! Hey, hey. What's going on? He's a reporter, he's trying to get into the house. I'm only trying to do my job. Yeah, we'll do it somewhere else. A man was killed here. I don't want to talk to you. You heard what the lady said? I'm confronting it can help. She doesn't want to. Is this any of your business? Yeah. And I'm telling you to get lost. Friendly little neighbourhood this has turned out to be. I'm surprised Des Barnes survived as long as he did. Look, I'm warning you. Was it a gangland killing? Kevin! Look! Get lost! I want me to get aggressive. If the lady wants me to go, I'll go. My condolences. You won't find another cellar with 50 grand you can get your thieving hands on. She hey, was no, my no, fault. Take hey, double cross Give me. He's only after the money. Kevin. You didn't even want to accept to use her for the punch bag. Yeah. But it was me she wanted to be with, though, wasn't it? Hey, no. See, Kevin, rolling in the street, do no good at all. Don't sully around with this pile of muck. 
The only thing he did wrong was getting mixed up with you. Your son tried to kill me. You lying cow. Hey, get off me. Go on, let go of it. Or what? Or else I'll meet you. That's it. Look, if you want to get tough with anyone, pick on a bloke. I'll oblige you any day you want. Runs in the family picking on women is the same as Greg. You keep your mouth shut about Greg. And you, you want to keep her at home instead of letting her out pulling young men. She's only telling the police that our Greg's been belting her. Yeah, well, he did. I saw the damage. Our Nick had to drag him off her. You can keep out of this plat. Look, I'm telling you, if I see you bothering her, or I hear of you bothering her, then I'm going to come looking for you. I thought it best to get to the hospital and check her out. She's fine. Yeah, no thanks to you. She could have been killed. Hey, nobody's more sorry about this than I am. You know, I knew something like this had happened. You're just not fit to look after kids. I turned me back for half a minute left. Yeah, well, it's not going to happen again. Come on, kids. You're coming to stay with me till your mum gets back. No, they're staying with me. <laughs> You're joking, aren't you? They'd be safer in a minefield than in the house with you. They're my responsibility. And they're my children. Could you sort this out somewhere else? You're upsetting the girls. What, you think he cares about that? All he's bothered about is scoring a few points off me. I'm warning you. Oh, what? Kevin, the wonderful father who can do no wrong. You love these girls so much, you went off with another woman. Oh, hey, that's enough, you know. Kevin. You want to play off me families? Find somebody else's kids to do it with, cos you're not doing it with mine. And it'll be easier in the shop, won't it? Now you're not on your own. Yeah. You let her take your coat off? Or did you tell her the clout to you before she even put her bags down? What are you talking about? You know exactly what I'm talking about. Any chance you get to make me look bad in front of Sally, you're in there. Hey, you don't need my help on that score. Not while you're belting other blokes in front of your kids. Yeah, well, I was angry, wasn't I? And you'd be angry too if someone had hurt one of your kids. Oh, they practically are my kids. Oh, you what? Kevin, no! Goes in something, my kids. Mine and Sally's. Now, you might have me wife and me house, but you'll never have me kids. Just cut it out, Kevin. Leave him alone. Hey, hey, what's going on? Nothing. Oh, grow up, will you? But when are you going to get it into your thick skull that she just doesn't want you back? <laughs> oh, oh, right. What's this, then? Another punch up? Very mature, Kevin. Oh, don't patronise me. I'm not one of these geriatric patients. I love Sally, all right? Love? You don't know the meaning of the word. Oh, right, right. You're an expert, are you? Yeah, you're supposed to love Gail. Then that bit of skirt Rebecca came along. Yeah, all right. I made a mistake, but I've learned. OK? What have you done? <laughs> Cleared off. This is our wedding. Sally, it's not too late. I said cleared off if you know what's good for you. Oh, he knows. It's about time he did. Sally, talk to me. If you tell me you're doing what you want to do, I'll walk away. Do, do I have to punch your bloody lights out? Don't what? you dare hit him! Why that, do you? Hey, hey, enjoy hey, it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it. Stop it. Get off! Let me kill him, Jeff! Get home! And you, get back to work. Look, do you pretend you enjoy being home? No. Here he is. The imaginary cook cold. I want to know what's going on. Well, there's a joke. Same as you are. You better start taking this serious. There's nothing to take seriously, Keith. It's ridiculous. You know what? You're as bad as he is. Get away from me! Yes! Get out of Hey! Get out Get out of Get out of Hey! Get out of Get out of Get out of Get out Get out of Get out of Get out Get out Get Get up, man! Get up! Shut up! Hey, Kevin. Hey, what's the problem? Oh, problem solved. You keep sat on with other blokes' wives, but stay away from mine, do you hear me? Stay away from Sally. Try it on. Is that what she told you? Don't you dare deny it. Oh, I wouldn't, mate. I wouldn't. Good! It's only half the story. Oh, I tried it on. But then I tried it out. You what? We had an affair. Oh, she was more than willing. Thanks for the loan, Kevin. You can take her back now. I've filled my boots. Get off! Get off there! Leave me alone, you! Get off! Hey, it's up to you what you believe. But you've got to ask yourself, why would I lie? Not me! You said you were buying not me! Fitz, I'm sorry. John, I didn't tell them! Nobody buys not me! No, you need to let me explain to you, to all of you. It was just a mistake. Bill, stop it! Oh, Kevin! Kevin!
diving down! Jimmy! That's enough! That's enough! We let you into our home. She was only 16. You're lucky you don't kill you. Get her in the house! Hey, look, you know, you think you're untouchable. You think you can get away with anything. I'll tell you this. If you've laid one finger on her, I'll flame and kill you. Funny how my daughter weren't no leso till she hooked up with your freak of a daughter. Dad. Oh, there should be a law against you two. Encouraging it under your own roof. Do you get some kind of perverse kick out of it? Dad! <laughs> you don't come into my house and speak to me like that. Are you tell him, Dad? You know. But she's twisted my daughter's mind. She's abused her. Oh, she you come out! Out. Get out! Sean's 15. I'm 16, our church just shows how much you know. Get out before I throw you out. You're making yourself look ridiculous. Get this door open now! Oh. What's all the racket about? Uh. Hey, no! No! What is going on with you in her head? Don't, Kevin! Come on, let's settle this man to Don't, man! Please. Don't you kid yourself, Sal! He's only doing this to get back at me for Molly. He'd never fancy you. Uh, Who does he think he is? Don't we have a I saw you! Yeah. Creeping out of that house first thing this morning! She's sneaking out yours now! You think I'm totally daft? Mum, Tyrone, that is so tacky! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Hey. Big one now, hey, No! Big one! Oh, please don't! This ain't over! So go away, come on. Kev, listen, right? I don't. Oh! <laughs> Kevin, no! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> you wanna get your own back? So do I! That's to the grave site. You think we're quits after what you did? After what you did! Just stop it and leave him alone! Go away, Kevin! I haven't finished with you. Either of you! Showtime. Oi! Have you heard from your mates yet? Who? You know who? Then who ripped me off? They're not my mates. Leave her alone. 20 grand you lost me. It wasn't my fault. Give me my money back. I haven't got it. I don't believe you. I reckon you put Sophie up to it. I didn't. I said it. You brainless my daughter. She was a good, responsible kid till she got involved in your cult. We were just trying to help people. Help yourself. Better do something. Right. No, I'll leave them to it. Get off it. Don't just shout. Hey, 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 come on, come on, come on. Someone's going to pay for this. Yeah, well, James, they're just as much a victim as you. Yeah, we'll see what the police has to say about that. But I'm really sorry. Yeah, you will be. Did you tell her about Sally's cancer? About Sophie Sean? Oh, she needs a bit of background. Tell it, Go on, you heard it. Is he in? Kev. You little chewed out, Kev. Kev, Kev. No, leave him. Go to what's happened, does it? Go on, tell him. Yeah. No guts. All right, Kevin, know you're upset. Upset? Not even close, mate. My little girl is lying in an hospital bed waiting to have a spine operated on. Terrified she might never walk in. Because of you. No, it's not his fault. No. Ask him, hey? After he shoveled so much cocaine up his nose, decided to play silly beggars on the road. He nearly got hit by a car, but Sophie saved him. Now you're sat here, she's lying there, terrified, not knowing. I didn't, I didn't mean it to. Yeah, but she did. She was watching your back, which is more than you did for her. How could you just leave her in that road? I, I stayed with her till the ambulance came. Yeah, and then you started running away. She could have died. Alone. With no one with her, she knew. You know what? I've just left her talking to the police. Oh, God. And for the life of me, I will never understand why she's refusing to give you up. Says it's some random guy. Well, if it was left to me. You know what? You don't deserve to breathe the same air as that girl. You're a waste of space. But I'm warning you, she doesn't pull through this. All right, mate, come on. Yes, nice try, pal. What are you doing? Yeah, call this. Yes. What's me head? What's me head? Get out of there. Ah, don't stop me. Ow, what's me head? Look, get off me head. I warned you. You know I could have you another one. <laughs> what the hell do you think you're doing? So, come on. I came over to try and bury the hatchet for Anna. What? 
I'm finding their up ill work, as you can no doubt see. It looked like he was going to throttle to me. This is doing neither of us any good, this dispute. He told me I had to apologise, and if I didn't, he's going to make matters worse for me. So you were threatening her? I simply want people to know the truth. This picture she's putting out of me is some kind of a ogre. I'm as easy going as the next guy, but there are limits. Things should go. You're not telling me you're starting to believe this, are you? No! Look, mate, if your name had been dragged through Have the Have you mold... not heard what I said? Fair enough. I got no quarrel with you. But not much of a one with her, despite what she says. So I'll, uh, leave you both to it. Two of the box of matches. <laughs> <laughs> Eileen! You, uh, want to watch what you're doing messing with him? I better tell you. And you? Me? You don't know what you're meddling with. What are you talking about, Kev? I'd back off if I were you, Kev. Oh, yeah? Or else what will you do? Pin me up against the wall and threaten me, like you did with Anna this afternoon. Well? Oh. Cat got your tongue. I never laid a finger on Anna. I saw you. You saw me? You think about that, Kev. When you came into the cafe, what exactly did you see? Did you see me hitting her? Well, no, Did but... you see me even touching her? No, but it was no, obvious. Exactly. Look, you had been, no. But did you see that? Look, why, why else would you be that close to her? Oh, I admit, I was at the end of my tether. This is the woman who smashed my van up last week, who goads me every time I try to talk to her. So shout, get angry, oh yes, today. I finally did that. But lay my hands on her or any other woman? Not my style, Kev. What exactly did you say, Kev? I saw enough. But you just admitted he didn't lay a hand on her. You can't go flinging accusations about Kev. He's got you wrapped round his little finger. Okay, well, while we're here, have you got any accusations against Eileen or Jason? Seems that everybody else is at fault here except you and Anna. Oh! Hey. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that woman's wrong. She's wrong in the head. I saw what she did to his van. So, if you and Anna have got any charges to bring against me, then do it through a court of law. We'll see how they stand up. Otherwise, just... Please, leave me alone. Come on. All right, mate. Yeah, I'm fine. Just uh, wondering when my van's going to be ready. Get someone else to fix it. Yeah, that's how you feel. I know something went on between you and Anna. Not a good idea to cross me, Kevin. I'm gonna dig till I get the truth. Happy digging, Kev. Let's hope you don't discover more than you bargained for. <laughs> <laughs> 